今天请来了来自于 Money Grant 他的首席执行官，这个 Pasley 女士来一起聊一下。A lot of people um like to transfer their money overseas, and uh, uh, which direction you are seeing are getting more popular now? There are about I think 16,000 quarters or country pairs where money moves. Um, and so the U.S., there's mm -hmm. a large, it's just U.S. to U.S., mm -hmm. U.S. outbound, and I would say the U.S. sends almost everywhere. Mm -hmm. U.S. to Mexico would be the largest outbound corridor for the U.S. Um, in Washington, people are talking about immigration reform. If they pass the, uh, the aggressive reform, do you think that will um, stimulate the business in your company? Yes, uh, you know, I think it, it uh, my view is anything that's good for the U.S., and I personally believe immigration reform is good for the U.S., is good for MoneyGram. And most of our U.S. consumers already have bank accounts. Some have said, oh, if there's immigration reform, then your customers will just get bank accounts and they won't use, you know, money transfer services. That's not true at all. Most of our customers already have bank accounts today. It is ease of service, convenience, convenience on the, on the receive side. It's a 10-minute money transfer service. It's very cost effective, very efficient. And uh, so I think it'll be very good for our business. The internationalization can be slowed down because the Eurozone is not so good and the other countries are not doing so well. Are you worried about that too? You know, Europe is... Uh, is not, not strong. I'll be positive. I'll say it that way. The, you know, the economies are not very strong right now. But when you look at it and you look around the world, the G6 or the G8 countries, you know, just to maintain their GDP, let alone grow it, they have to rely on a guest worker program. They have an aging population. They have a low birth rate. And, the, you know, our consumer is resilient and they move for work because at the heart of it, they're providing for a better way of life for their family.